Hey, this is JR, AKA The Tourist, and I'm here with another hotel impression. Today I'm in Hong Kong, the city that I called home for eight years to show you the Hari Hotel. This is one of two hotels worldwide operating under the Hari brand. The other is in London's Belgravia neighborhood. The brand is owned by the Hong Kong-based Harilela Group. The Haris are the standout in the group's portfolio, which mostly includes medium-range properties throughout Asia. At 210 rooms, the Hari Hotel is not small, but it does maintain the look and feel of an upscale boutique hotel. Some will find the rooms a bit cramped, but this is Hong Kong. Welcome to the Hari Hotel, Hong Kong. This is not a review, but merely my impression of the property. You first experience the Hari from the very stylish driveway and the ground floor lobby. There's a small desk to welcome you, but check-in happens upstairs on the first floor. Two of my favorite things about the Hari are the stylish interiors and the art. The art is on display from the moment you enter the lobby and continues as you step out of the elevator onto the reception floor. Check-in happens at one of the several desks sitting just past the elevators. I checked in after dark, at which time you can fully experience the ambiance of the Hari. Normally, I would go straight to the room, but the reception area flows seamlessly into the lounge area, so let's have a quick walk around. You will continue to see the art pieces that I just mentioned and also see what I mean about the stylish decor. What I like about the art here is that it's aesthetically interesting and melds with the overall design aesthetic. It doesn't waste too much time trying to convince me that it's some deep conceptual statement on climate change or whatever social issue of the day. In addition to being the reception area, this floor is also home to the lounge one of the Hari's four food and beverage outlets. The lounge does light bites and cocktails. I'll show you the other restaurants later in the video. I love a comfortable, nicely lit seating area. Can you see yourself here, sitting back, drink in hand, or leaning forward to better hear your companion, sharing a snippet of conversation, or a knowing glance? Let's not linger too long. We have the room to see. I booked a corner room, which is a step up from the standard king room. The room rate was $270 US. If you stay at the Hari, I recommend booking the corner room. I'll show you why in a moment. The design of the room is both minimalist, but with little touches of marble and brass that make it feel contemporary. If you are enjoying this tour and wish to see future hotel impressions and more, please consider liking the video and hitting the subscribe button. I post a new hotel impression every Sunday. And I've got a couple of very nice videos coming up, including what may be Hong Kong's best hotel. There's a very small mini bar, but it does include complimentary bottled water and a coffee machine.
The fridge is empty. A few drink options might be nice, but there are many convenience stores nearby and in-room dining is available. It's not the biggest room and the view isn't great, although you can see Hong Kong's third tallest building. There's a small open closet area with two nice sized drawers. The bathroom is open as well, but the layout provides a decent amount of separation from the rest of the room. From the pictures online, the standard rooms have much less separation between the bathroom and the rest of the room. area is a little dark, but I suppose that goes with the overall feel of the hotel. The bathroom is all white marble, which does lend some brightness. The bathroom amenities are all Hari branded. Some of the packaging is a little on the mid-market side. The shower stall is a nice size and the water pressure is strong. The water closet finishes the tour of the room. There is no swimming pool at the Hari. There is a small gym. If you're after a full service, five star hotel, the Hari might not be for you. But the Hari is well located. The hotel is in Wan Chai, a neighborhood on Hong Kong Island that puts you between the entertainment of Central and the shopping of Causeway Bay. Wan Chai itself is full of bars and restaurants, so you'll have no want of nearby nightlife. And of course, the Hari itself has a certain alluring ambiance. Let's go back in and see the rest of the hotel. On the second floor, you'll find Zoku, a Japanese restaurant. And through the bar area, you can make your way out to the terrace, where you can dine from the Zoku menu or simply enjoy an evening drink. Back on the first floor, off of the lounge, is an Italian restaurant called Luciola. There are full service luxury hotels in Hong Kong at or near the Hari's price point. So if you're looking for the grand hotel experience, the Hari may not be for you. But if you're looking for an upscale boutique hotel experience, do consider the Hari the next time you're looking for a room in Hong Kong. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned for future hotel impressions and more. Thank you.